All right, so here activated buttons. It doesn't exist. And that's a shame because we can use them for like boss fights and stuff. But you see, I lied. There's this really weird functionality with, with a specific gear that lets it basically activate a button as long as you have a very small contraption. It's very easy, all right? This video is only like two minutes long because that's how simple it is. So there's this weird interaction where paintballs can affect push blocks. As you can see in this video, it's flinging around this uh, push block. It's, the thing is, this is a very thin push block and that's the only type of thing it works on. So this very thick push block that's like a stud thick, uh, you can't affect it with the paintball gun. But we can still use this to our advantage. So once you know this, it's actually not that hard of a system to make. So inside of the bullseye, we have this push block. It's purple and neon so you can see it. Anyways, this push block has to be very thin and small so it can actually be moved by the paintballs. Remember that or else it won't work and it'll get like stuck inside of the hole it's in. Anyways, when this push block falls, it triggers the button which triggers this moving part to start moving. It can also be used to trigger entire button contraptions, not just moving parts, obviously. As you can see, the neon purple push block has fallen over which triggered the button right under it which activated the moving part. See, no tricks. Look, this moving part is only activated by the button, which can only be activated by this one push block, which is inside of the target. If you want the push block to be hidden, you can make a bullseye with can collide off, so the paintball uh, bullet or whatever you want to call it can still go inside and move the push block that is inside of the can collide false bullseye, or the blue part that I put inside. If you want to hide it even more, you can always set the transparency to 0.99 and turn the material on to force field. To be honest, there's only a few functionalities of this, it's just a cool trick. You can make it for like boss fights, for the target shooting minigame or something like that. You can figure something out, right? I mean, Obby Creator is a game of creativity, alright? So, I'm not gonna give everything for you. So, um, I gotta come clean about something to you guys. For the past few years, I have been cooking crystallized methamphetamine or crystal meth for short. At first, I obviously did it for the money, but later on, after around two years, I realized the true reason deep within my heart as to why I started cooking. I liked it. I was good at it. And I felt alive. 